Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first ever non-stop wrestling ECW. My name is Joey Mild and I'm alongside Maz Freeway. Maz, good evening. Hey, it's great to be here, Joe. And we are here for ECW. Yes, it's extreme. And Maz, we're going to kick things off with the UK Kid versus the Beast. Well, this will be a very interesting matchup with the Beast and UK Kid. We haven't seen either one of these, so it'll be interesting to see what they can bring to extreme wrestling here. And we are live, ladies and gentlemen. We're not like tape shows. We haven't got fancy pyros. We haven't even got the proper ring music for our competitors. We're here to just bring you solid chair shots, probably guitar, guitar shots. Even if the fans like to bring crutches to the ring, they'll probably do that as well. And Maz, that's what makes us different to them Raw and SmackDown guys. Yeah, we try to bring you the most fast, hard-paced, hardcore action ever. Well, we are just going to get right to it. And here is the UK kid. As you probably know, you'll probably see our guys probably do the same entrance with the same music. But who cares? It's all about the wrestling. Yes, the wrestling here on ECW. And well, Maz, this kid is from the UK. Obviously, that's why he's the UK kid. And he looks like he's ready for action. Yeah, it seems like he's ready to go. Hopefully, the Beast will be able to bring what he can bring to this matchup and be able to take down this UK kid. Well, he's ready for action and he's looking towards the ring there. Lovely, lovely attire he's got on there tonight. Of course, our ring announcer is, of course, as always, uh, Justin Tobatz. He's here tonight. He'll be looking at the competitors' bums all the way through this contest. So, Maz... Yeah, I think he might swing both ways on that fence. I'm sure he does. I'm sure he doesn't sit on that most evenings. Well, the UK kid here, ready for action. As a capacity crowd here in the nice bingo hall here we've got here in Newcastle, England. So the UK kid should be one of the favourites. Here comes his opponent, the Beast. The Beast, of course. Signed to ECW. Already had a great college career and did a lot of things in the collegiate style, so see if he can transfer over to this hardcore style of wrestling. And of course we're saving money, Matt, by using the same ring entrance and of course the same music for our competitors. Yeah, we're not all about the flash, we're all about the in-ring competitors and how good they can do their hardcore styles. And of course, here is William the Beast. What a name. And what a lovely t-shirt he's got on. Well, he definitely loves his wrestling. Well, the crowd... Oh, well, he's having a... He's stopping there, having a nice shake of the head. And Maz, you've got to see... What an opening contest to ECW. Yeah, this should be a very good technical back-and-forth matchup between these two. Well, you see that. And the fans, they're already praying for blood. They want to get this extreme, extreme match underway. As, of course... Justin Tibblesworth there. Uh, you will notice his name changes through the night. Uh, it's due to poli police protection. Uh, he was in robbery a couple of years ago. But anyway, we'll move on from that. As a... That and all of his pedophile experiences. Of course, yes. Not allowed near a school within 200 yards. Well, William the Beast there. Ready for action. Remember, guys, if you want to target that limb, make sure you do so by holding that RB button. And uh, we are just about under. And remember, all our ECW matches are, have got a 15 minute time limit. If the competitors can't beat the living crap out of each other by then, well, it will be a draw. And we don't want to see draws here, Matt, obviously, tonight. Baz. Nope. Best to get that win as quick as possible. Bloody your opponent fast and quick. And of course, we love the blood here on ECW. Of course. We want all blood. And of course, you can see. A, our, ring, our fans in the ring wearing their lovely yellow t-shirts, hoping that they don't get splattered with blood on them. And as you see, technical wrestling early on. And remember, all our matches do our falls count anywhere, so you can beat the living crap out of your component outside the ring and get a pinfall. All objects are available to be used. Tables, chairs, ladders, bells, ring, anything you can. Even your belt, Maz. <laughs> They can whip them like a government mule. Even the laptop here that the commentator's booth can be used. 
Uh, well, look at this. Oh, there's that shot to the head. Oh, and a nice crossbody. Lovely kind of shot there early on. And as of course, tonight we're going to crown our first ECW champion a little bit later on. I'm sure that's going to be excitement for the fans here. In our yeah, we'll have to see who will we'll be a four-way title match there. Uh, well, you're close enough. It's three, but here ho. Uh, uh, mistakes happen. Triple threat. <laughs> of course, there'll be a fatal three-way later on. That'll be coming up. And uh, look at this. Oh, yeah. Going for the sledgehammer. This is what we like to see. Big boots using weapons. Oh, but there's that nice elbow again. Yeah, the beast caught him off guard. Mm. Just look at the arms of that guy. Wouldn't like a bear hug off him. Oh, nice drop kick though. UK kid looking for some more weapons. Yeah, but uh, William the Beast, of course, is a beast. Was in American college. He got the name the Beast. Because he decided to mule three college kids for no apparent reason. Oh, and there's that elbow drop on the outside. Oh, well, maybe he can bring out the hardcore style and we can start calling maybe William the Bloody. Oh, there's that crotch. He's just took it off a disabled fan. Why would he do that? And then he gets hit with it by the UK kid. Fans here in Newcastle, England, looking for blood. UK kid standing up for that UK fan out there. Yeah, indeed. Someone's got a guitar there. Obviously a Jeff Jarrett fan. Oh, and again that shoulder tackle. And you can hear the fans saying, get the tables. And we got about 12 more minutes left in this matchup coming up. Oh, it might be over here, though. Lovely camera angle there. Only a two. And the UK kid. So oh, nice backbreaker. And another cover, another great camera shot there from our camera men. Remember, we only do have three cameras because we can't afford any more. Oh, dear me, flipping him off. And there's the lovely stunner. I think nice this view from camera three. Yeah, exactly. Camera, camera two. Yeah, camera one. And that is it. A big win for the beast. What a way to start ECW, Maz. Yeah, he tore right through that UK kid. And the UK kid somehow warps over to the other end of the ring. Uh, lovely camera angle shot there from number two. And uh, the Beast, I'm sure we're going to see a lot more here in ECW. Yep, as soon as he starts getting more acquainted to this extreme style of matches. Well, that's a big win. And of course, the generic music plays as he tells the referee he doesn't give a sh... Yeah, you know what about that. And, uh, well, there's the win. Uh, it's now we have to get ready for our next match. So we have to go off there and let you, everyone know that we are brought to you by Nonstop Wrestling. Of course, the number one wrestling company on the internet. Ma Maz, do you want to just sort of say something while I try and get the next match set up? Yeah, I, I implore all our fans or any fans that are tuning in to watch this first ECW show to tune into any of the NX, or NSW uh, Raw, Main Event, SmackDown, or NXT shows. The more yeah. fans that we can get to watch the shows, the better they get, and the more superstars we'll have, and the better the shows we'll get. We're just waiting for the competitors backstage to get ready for this next contest. And it's actually going to be some people who are... Somebody who was in NXT last season on non-stop wrestling, Goldust. He's going to take on uh, Carl James. Extreme Rules coming up. Just waiting for the competitors to get ready for this one. This should be a very good, brutal matchup between these two. Or there's been a lot of back, backbiting in the backstage about these two wrestlers. They really aren't getting along with each other. Of course. And Goldust still bit after being dropped by NSW last season. Wants to make his way back into the main shows. But of course, ECW is where you want to be. Who cares about Raw, Smackdown and that. When you can get the extreme rules of us every single week. And we are ready. For our next match. Of course, if you want to go for that midsection damage, make sure you press the A button. It sounds like Goldust is done putting on his makeup and he's ready to go. Hope so. Let's let's see yeah, if we get some actually more decent music this time. 
But we don't care. And uh, the extreme one's coming out first. In fact, we've saved more music by having no music at all. Nice towel. Oh, his music is playing, I've just been told. Well, they're better late than never. Well, there you go. And of course, the bizarre one. Lovely, lovely towel. Actually fits his outfit quite well. Very bizarre. Well, we will see if he can get to the bizarre world of ECW. Yeah, tonight. Be very interesting to see how he can adapt to this extreme style of ECW compared to being in NSW. Oh, I got a bit of a frog in me foot there. Got to just get that out there and American flag there because he's very patriot. So you had a Frenchman in your throat. A Frenchman in my throat. <laughs> got to happen all the time here on ECW. Never know what's going to pop up or pop in. One of the two. And of course, Carl James is opponent. And indeed, he can fly. Yeah, this guy's been known to take risks that most people wouldn't even consider doing. Well, what an episode. And of course, definitely this time, this guy does not have any music. I'm afraid we used all our money up for gold dust that we actually couldn't afford any for this guy. Yeah, but he looks very excited to be here, ready to go. Why wouldn't you? Why would you not be excited to be in ECW? The land of extreme, of course. Our ring announcer this one, David Dunsworth. Ready for the introductions. Checking that booty out. Liking the way he shakes it, I think. Oh, yes. Got to get ready for this one. And of course, make sure you get your chain grapples in. By pressing that A button. And the left stick. So we are underway. 15 minute time limit at the bottom of your corner. This is not a hard, this is not a Iron Man match. That's the time limit for the match itself. Baz, we've seen already Extreme here tonight. Should we see Extreme in this match? Uh, I think we're going to definitely see something Extreme from these two. Uh, I can definitely see Carl taking some major risks and really having some good time in this match. And the question you've got to ask yourself, Maz, the big question that everybody wants to know, how the hell does that make up stay on all the way through this match? I hear you ply it multiple times just to keep it on there. Well, what about the makeup? Yeah, that too. And Carl James going after Goldust here. Oh, nice goop and a slam. And dropping the knee right across the face. That's not going to help. If that makeup starts to run, you're gonna, not going to see anything in your eyes for a while. Yeah, it's going to take more than a knee to crack that face paint. That's true. It is like cement. As a lovely drop kick. Fancy a little bit restless already. Want to see some hardcore action? And these two really starting to, hear, starting to hear the chance for the tables. That's true. And look at this gold dust. Oh, tried to talk and another kick to the midsection. Remember, it's everything allowed apart from them. No to the groins. Got to keep away from that groin area. Seeing that the gold dust will probably go for the groin area, but hey ho. Let's leave that for another story. As up, first time we see the chair tonight. And another sledgehammer. It's like being yeah, in a gold dust wedged that, wedged that chair in the turnbuckle there and got ready for to use it. It's like being in a supermarket, Maz. You can pick up weapons anywhere you like. Yep, trash cans, chairs, kendo sticks, sledgehammers is like being at Home Depot. Yeah. Home Depot, you and your American or, supermarkets, it's better be going to Asda, nice British supermarket, as a uh, gold dust thrown back inside the ring, everyone here at Newcastle, England, getting a bit excited, of course, during the intermission, you do have your bit of bingo, make sure you get that one line for £200, 
full house, get you a thousand. Oh, James, kicking them. No weapons used so far, though. Oh, there's a nice DDT, though, Maz. Now they brought out the weapons, but have yet to bring them into the match. Oh, and he has a ladder. Carl's grabbing that ladder. Yeah. yeah. I think he's ready to fly off that ladder. Yeah, he's got to be able to put it up, though, Goldust. Got to backdrop more. Oh, missed the ladder, though. Just think he caught his knee. And he has the first cover of the match. And we get a one. One only. Oh, and the Thank elbow. You for camera three. Oh, and I think that's the... Uh, I think he's opened him up. He's got a little bit of a uh, a bloody head there. As he's, oh, there's a lovely camera angle there from uh, camera one. Remember, three expensive cameras. I don't know why we didn't buy least expensive ones. We could have got more. Carl's still hanging in here, though. He's still keeping a fight going on, even though being bloodied by gold dust. Yeah, of course, that wound being open. Can't have that. Oh, nice elbow again. Goldust being aggressive. What the hell is this? Oh, it snaps the neck. I think that hurt Goldust more than it did James. Into the cover. Oh, and it's over. Goldust is your winner. Yep, Goldust making a statement. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. The man with the theme music wins this one. Right there you see where he bloodied him. And of course that great camera angle there. Great production work from our three cameramen. I think cameraman three might be a little drunk, so. Well, just getting in the, of course, the, the spirit here tonight on our opening ECW show. Well, that's what happens when they give away free beer at the beer stands. What? Free beer? I didn't you didn't hear about this. that one? Oh. What the hell? Well, maybe there'll be some left when we're done the show. Don't think so, not with this thirsty crowd. And we've got one more match to come, ladies and gentlemen. It is your ECW title match. It'll be, of course, a fatal three-way. And we're, of course, going to have some exciting characters in that one. Um, Goldust is your winner. And as I make sure I exit this match, I make sure you have a look at our place boards for our non-stop wrestling colleagues. Make sure you watch them show through the week. Matt, do you want to talk a bit more? Maz, do you want to talk yep. a bit more? We're getting ready to set up for this uh, menage a trois championship matchup between three great competitors here in the uh, ECW. Getting ready to crown our first ever ECW champion and set off our show onto the next plateau. What the bullshit was that? <laughs> the hell are you on about? This is ECW. Arch I see W, damn it. You've been watching yeah, ECW. You've been watching that bloody NSW too much again. Well, do you know that we have signed some great competitors, Maz, for this one? And again, former NSW competitor in this one in J Masters. Yeah, former Money Club member. Yeah. And he's going to take on a legend in this business, an absolute legend in John Morrison. A big signing for us here in ECW. And also, he is going to take on Antonio Sanchez. I think Antonio Sanchez may be the wild card in this matchup. Well, the unknown person in the matchup that no one really hasn't seen yet. So You've got to see to believe that we have signed John Morrison. I'm even more excited than anyone in this arena. Of course, it's all 15 minutes time limit to all our matches. Well... We are right to go, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that! There he is! John Morrison, the legend. J Masters, sort of a legend. Antonio Cesaro, um, Antonio Cesaro, Antonio Sanchez, a complete rookie. Let's go. And remember, if you get a stunned grapple, uh, you can do some moves on him. Of course. It'd be interesting to see what music we've got for these three guys, as they're not going to be obviously the real ones. No, we don't pay much for music around this place, so. You never know, it might improve if we get viewers. 
considering that though we've lost three since the, the show started. Now, some people just can't handle the hardcore lifestyle and can't stand to see the sight of blood, so. That's true. And, whoa, what the hell? The hell was that all about? A little bit of editing from our one of our three cameramen. Yeah. And the superstar. Have to get that changed for next week. Yeah, I think this was kind of a quick signing that they didn't know that he was showing up here, so they weren't quite prepared for him. Got to say thank you to our graphic designers who uh, did a great job there. And of course, the ring announcer for this one, Tim Huddleston. He'll be, of course, doing the introductions. John Morrison is the first guy out. Well, take your time, lad. Ah, here he comes. Sounds like he's from WCW with this kind of music. Well, there's a lot of fans here tonight, but where the hell is Jay Masters? Ah, there Maybe he is. He's having a monster. As you know, this guy was in NSW last year, got released, and now he's in ACW. Yeah, I heard he left uh, when he left uh, NSW. I'm going into some kind of an MMA career for a few minutes, and didn't do do. do his do too well in there, so I guess he decided to try out his hardcore styles. Well, of course, that MMA career lasted exactly 33 seconds when he was tapped out, just like his shirt says, uh, by leg lock. Well, hopefully he can last a little bit longer in this matchup and maybe become the first ever ECW champion. Well, we're going to find out in this one Still got one more to come, remember. It is indeed Beatle three ways. Can't wait for this one. Look at that. Lovely fist. Everybody loves a good fist in here on ECW. Uh, what about this guy, Matt? Uh, the underdog of the match, dude. Guy that no one really knows about. I think he's going to be the wild card. Well, I think he's going to—he's waiting for something. We we'll get him to the ring a bit quicker. We're we'll running out of time here. What a lovely, colourful shirt he's got on. Looks very furry. Looks like someone's just got pinned through it all over it. He's just got matching boots. You see, he's got very daunting music. Of course, you see our fans who managed to get two hot dogs for the price of one tonight as an opening offer. Very nice. Well, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. So good that they don't even show us the caption for our ECW title match. I'm sure I've seen that referee somewhere before, Maz. Uh, Maz is having another drink, I think. As uh, our competitors are ready. Remember, if you've got a breaking points admission, make sure you hold that eight to perform a breaking points admission. And off we go. And everyone misses. What a good start. Maz, what's the matter? Yes. Ah. Uh, we're going back, back and forth here. I thought, we thought we'd lost you. Thought that hot dog offer was too good to, to get. Nah, just dealing with some rowdy fans in the background. Ah. Uh, well, it's probably that hot dog deal. Oh, the only problem is, Matt. Maz. We'll call you Matt. I think Matt's a much better name for you than Maz, but anyway, let's move on. What uh, what happens if this time runs out? I guess maybe we'll go into a sudden death match. Uh, well, 
Oh, and a nice kick to the balls. What we like to see here next ECW. Oh, of course, any pin can be happen. Pin submission anywhere you like. As I'm just curious to see who's going to be the first to go after the weapons. That's true. All three men in the ring, same time. Oh, he has a nice double team. Nice suplex. Oh, Morrison outside. Morrison's getting some wood. Oh, yeah. Morrison's got a big piece of wood. Hope he doesn't. Well, he might use it on both competitors, not just one. Taking down Jay Masters with a nice hit. Oh, he said his wood's stolen. Oh, no, he's just drop kicked him. Of course, the fans wanting Morrison to win this one. Legend in his own bedroom. Oh, nice insecurity. So they're teaming up on Antonio Sanchez, get, taking him out. Yeah. Jay Mostas goes to the outside. Once again, that sledgehammer coming into play. You would think Triple H was in the building the amount of times we've used the sledgehammer tonight. Oh, into the midsection. And then right to his head. Jay Mostas using that weapon quite a few number of times. Oh, there goes the wood. And that got the fans up on their feet. Uh, yeah. Oh, here he comes. Stop it. Got to say, Morrison loves the wood here tonight. Crowd standing, which is not really allowed. You should all be sitting down. Double cutter by him. J Masters in for the pin. Yeah, J Masters looking to steal one. Morrison into the corner. Oh, referee trying to get in for some three-way action there. Nice drop kick by Sanchez. Morrison just trying to get in and sneak his way in every way. There's a cover. Have we got our first champion? No, we haven't. Which one of these do you think Maz will win this one? I don't know, J Master seems to have the upper hand in this matchup so far. He likes to use uh, that uh, sledgehammer. Oh, Sanchez running about with a chair. Maybe want to sit down, or maybe want to crack someone's skull in. I think the second option sounds a lot better. Right, wedged it in the corner there, he's getting ready to set somebody up for it. Don't know why the referee went over to check if it was still wedged. I think the referee's trying to get in this hardcore action as well. Mosters hit two drop kicks. And the neck breaker. Morrison looks to be in a lot of pain. Oh! Definitely then, pain there. Yeah, there goes the head. To the outside. Now everyone trying to beat up. They're using Morrison like a rag doll. To the midsection again, Morrison trying to fight back. Oh, nice neck breaker. That might do it. Yeah. Sanchez looking to hit the big elbow, which he does. Morrison getting a bit too excited. And a lovely Russian leg sweep. By Sanchez. Oh, oh and that takes him down. Lovely. Into the cover. Master sneaking in there. Yeah, Masters. Sneaky devil trying to nick one. Trying to nick the ECW title right under the noses of Morrison. Sanchez. Oh, yes. Sanchez, have, have enough of that, you legend. I think they're going to have to get one of these men out the ring, Maz. Yeah, you're going to have to take both men down before you can actually get the pinfall, I think, in this match. Oh, nice spinning heel, Chaos. Don't want to damage that good looking face. We'll do so though if that happens.
Morrison again, midsection. And he's going to go for. Oh, he's going for a ladder. What's Morrison going for here? On the top rope. Ooh, elbow to the back. Into the cover, trying to steal one. Uh, May get it. No. There's nowhere near. And another sort of soup. Uh, this. Look at this. This J Master is trying to sneak in. Trying to sneak in every time. And now Morrison's got the ladder. Taking both men out. Morrison. May have the right idea here. Hit the ref. He needs to be taken out as well. He likes to get involved. Sanchez. Ah, lovely neck breaker. Into the cover. Nope. Only got eight minutes left. We need someone to be a champion soon. Oh, and he missed. Maz, who's going to win this one? Someone's going to win it, surely. This could be Antonio Sanchez's spot right here. Nope. Oh, Bit of a roll up, schoolboy. Morrison's in the corner. Oh, look at that. Morrison cuts Sanchez off. That's what he needs to do. Oh, stacking them up in the corner. What the hell is he doing? Uh oh. Starship pan. Pin, whatever you want to call it. For the ECW moves. Gotta learn these. Very back and forth between all three guys here in this matchup, and no one's ever really gotten the clear advantage. Mm. They beat the living poo out of each other. I'd love to see. Master does again trying to sneak one. Oh, nice knee to the fierce. Into the cover. You've got to see, Maz, when do you get worried that one of these people aren't going to win in the next six and a half minutes? I'd say when we get in about three minutes, they, they might start turning it up to try and pick off the weakest opponent. Well, Morrison, it's another lovely Russian leg sweep. There's the cover. Morrison's trying to swing through the hills. Oh, there and you go. Jay, hey. Jay Masters picks up the win. Imagine you're still there. Yeah. I think you, you might cut off. See it again. Yeah, that was an amazing matchup. And Jay Masters was coming out with the stealing of that victory. It was unbelievable. And now he's the new ECW champion. That's great. We have crowned, ladies and gentlemen, our first ECW champion right here tonight. What a momentous occasion. And you've all been here to witness greatness. Especially when John Morrison tried to hit thin air with that shot. And ladies and gentlemen, there is your new ECW champion. The first ECW champion, of course. J Masters. And guys, that is it. ECW is over. If you want to see extreme action each week, well, we're on every couple of weeks, so don't come to see us until two weeks' time, of course. And, uh, in fact, it might be next week. We never know. It's whenever we get the time slot. Whenever non-stop sport let will come on. Um, Maz, I think that's it. Yep. Uh, well. Say thanks. Say thanks to them for being here. Thanks for being here. That's it. <laughs> it's over. Julie Mild, Maz, see ya. <laughs>